How are you guys doing, Eric here? Today is Tuesday, June 11th, 2019, and uh, a little something happened at work today, so we ended up taking the day off. So I thought I would come stop at the Home Depot, get a couple supplies, and use the day to do a little more work on my woodshed here. It's coming together nicely. I got the I got the roof all on, and. What I'm going to do today is I got these two 2 by 6s here. I'm going to use those to finish these two corners here. It'll really, add, it'll really strengthen up the structure. And then I can take that brace off. And then I got some 16 day nails. 3.5 inch galvanized nails to add some more nailing for these 2 by 6s and some other areas. And... It dawned on me, I'm thinking, what am I gonna use for the walls on this? And I'm like, you know, cedar picket fence, speeder, cedar fence pickets. Damn, I just spit on my camera when I said that. They're pretty nice. They're nice cedar, they're cheap. These are like, well, I don't know, cheap, but relatively I'm thinking they were, I think they were like $2.60 each. So I figure I got 10 of them, so you figure it's about 30 bucks. But yeah, these are gonna. Go, I'm gonna put these, nail these to the sides, like so, and space them out. And that's gonna be. It's gonna be my side. That's gonna be my walls. Very simple. Saw depth. Okay. okay, so I've got my piece cut, ready to fasten it into place. See how she fits. Oh, just the way I like it. Oh yes. Good. Yeah. That's a good fit. Now, I got this drill set up to drill a pilot hole. Nice and lined up with that bottom. right underneath that knot. Drill right through that knot. All right, snap that knot in two. So now, okay. That'll hold it in place, give it some strength. Now, put some nails in.
Yes. There we go. That's gonna make that corner super strong. Right. You can see what the corners look like now. And I'm thinking of, before I take that brace off, I'm gonna I got these two pieces of two by six left over. I'm gonna take them and I think I'm just gonna fasten them on the inside. There at a 45 degree angle to add some extra strength. All right. I think that looks pretty good. What do you think? Yeah, it adds a little bit of flavor to the thing. And strength, I was able to take the brace off. And you can see, and come over here. It's pretty damn sturdy going that way, so. Still a little bit shaky that way, but I'm gonna brace up this wall and that wall before I put this stuff on. Yeah, it's coming together pretty cool, man. I'm thinking I might, before I go any farther, I wanna, I wanna do some more work on it, get some of these on there today, but I'm thinking I might wanna First, I want to get some stain and stain that wood before I cover it up. Thinking, I want to get something that's going to be like, make it look green like everything else. Or should I just go ahead and cover it up? I don't know. But anyways, yeah, it's looking pretty cool, man. I, that's, that's important to me that it looks cool, man. You know, be a pleasing structure, good feng shui in the yard and functional. So yeah, I want it to look nice and be functional. So that's what I'm trying to accomplish with this thing. So, yeah, I guess uh, I got a little bit of extra work here on it today, and I'll probably get back on it on the weekend. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you guys soon.